So while going through some of my old figure collections, I found this six inch snake eyes figure that someone had made and um, they must have gotten copies made in China or whatever because it was on sale on eBay for quite a while. Um, he comes with everything the three and three quarter inch figure came with. His backpack, the sword, his rifle, and even the figure stand, it's dusty, um, with the foot pegs in it. Comes with his little bandolier, belt, he's got articulation in the chest, um, at the knees, he's got a double joint. I've had him probably 15 years now. And um, I always thought he was just a great figure, like a, a really cool one-off. Um, unfortunately, I, I had never seen another one done. I, I heard a rumor that somebody was supposed to, the guy was supposed to do um, Storm Shadow, but I guess never did. Um, but a really neat figure. There's no paint apps on it. Everything is just black. So if you wanted to, I guess you could paint them, um, dry brush some grays in there. Um, paint the grenades, you know, make it make it stand out a little bit more. But I never did anything. I thought he was a really neat one-off, and I was happy to have him. Uh, as far as size goes, he's quite a bit smaller than a Marvel Legends figure. Um, I know Snake Eyes is supposed to be a little bit shorter, being that he's played by Ray Park in the movie. Um, so it, it could work if you wanted it to. And speaking of Ray Park, I found Darth Maul, which you can see they're much closer in height, which is kind of neat. I actually had gone to check out a Black Series figure just to see the height difference, and Darth Maul completely, just by chance, happened to be the figure I, I had found. So I thought, yeah, I'm going to stay with that since they're the same actor um, in the G.I. Joe movie and in Star Wars. Um, really love to see Hasbro or um, Mezco or another company do uh, a six inch line. I think that'd be fantastic to see G.I. Joe back since for me I'd stopped collecting 118th and I would really like to get some military figures into the either the Marvel Legends or even close to the Black Series size. That'd be that'd be fantastic. Anyway, I figured I'd show them off, and thank you for looking, and I will catch you later.